So here we are currently on tour in the Eyre Peninsula. We've got this beautiful bay behind us leading out to the National Park. And what I thought I'd do is just run you through the platypus lines and leaders that I've been using over the last year. They're really quality lines. I'll give you a bit of an idea what I use for what. Big one. So firstly, the Platypus Super Braid. Now I've used a lot of different braids in my time and there's one thing that I do not like is not being able to trust my braid. And what I've found with the Platypus Super Braid, it's just a good, honest braid. It is very strong, it's hard wearing, it ties fantastic knots, and particularly with things like cod fishing where you're only gonna get one shot in even days of fishing, you need to know that you can trust your braid and the Super Braid is just that. So for me, braid has to be easy to see. Now the super braid's a really nice yellow colour um, and that means I know exactly what my lure is doing at any point during the cast. And I've also found the yellow holds its colour and doesn't dull off like a lot of other braids do. So for my leaders, for anything under 20 pound, my first choice is the Stealth Fluorocarbon. It's super hard wearing, it's very strong for its diameter and they call it Stealth for a reason because if you're doing any of that finesse style of fishing, this should be your number one choice. Yep, got him, got him, got him, got him, got him. So now to the heavy stuff. And this is a new product from Platypus. It's the Hard Armor Tough Leader. And this is what I've been using for all of my cod fishing and it's been absolutely fantastic. So for my cod fishing, I've been using both the 60 and 80 pound. For the lighter applications, whether it's yellow fishing, flathead fishing, casting for big salmon off the beach or squidding, I've been using the 40 through to the 20 pound. So the best part, about the platypus range. It's Australian owned, they make products in Australia, and I think that's something we can all be very proud to fish.